Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are gonna make Angry Bird game on Scratch, and I'm gonna show you how it works. So I can like use this as a slingshot. So I can just shoot it anywhere. I can shoot it like this, like this, and like this. I have to hit the piggy. So I hit it by when I do like this. So now let's make it. So let's start. So I already like um, took the uh, sprites, and now let's uh, like make that slingshot thing. So, so now just paint one circle, just a dot, and another circle. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna place the circle here and the circle here. So. Now I'm gonna do one one more sprite. So I'll just uh, draw the sprite, and then so now what the sprite is gonna do is the sprite is gonna draw a line from this sprite to this sprite. So let me take the pen. Okay, the pen's already here. So now what I have to do is first I should erase all, then a green flag option above it add a forever block and now go to motion and take this go to sprite 2 which is this circle and now after that I'll just put pen down here so after that now what I have to do is I have to keep pen or this uh, this one should be sprite one. So what this will do is this will just draw a line. So first I I need to keep the pen down here and the pen up here. So you can see that uh, I didn't I kept the pen down up here without the pen I kept the pen down here without the pen up so look it made a line from here so that should not happen so now it did not happen so that's what we need so now let me make that uh, line get connected to this bird so now I'll just add go to which is this one now let's see how it is I place it here goes there okay. and one more thing I need to put here is to add in an erase block here and not there at the top so now it's like this so when I place it here it goes there without making making an, an extra line so the middle Okay, that's enough. So it should go to this position at the starting. And one more thing I need to do here is that I need to like um, set it in draggle, draggable mode so that I can drag it when I'm in full screen mode like this. So I can drag it around everywhere. Okay, so now when yeah, this position is better, so I'll just keep this one here. Yeah. This position here. And after that, you need to make three sprites. So paint and take just as rectangle. So just leave it in this color for now and we are going to change it to white after so after we do the program okay so i'm going to keep it here so this is like uh, so when the bird is like touching this it will like uh, say which direction the bird will be pointing and it will go in that direction so that's what is going to happen so I'm gonna 
make this even bigger this by adding an extra one here like this okay so now duplicate this and do it for the down part by flipping it and putting the front part here and I'll place it here and one more sprite just simply one line and then put it there this will go here okay so now go to this place and then add a forever block and now just add if touching touching the sprite six I'll keep the middle one it should point in 90 degrees now duplicate it and now for the sprite five just this one and it should point upwards and the last one which is the fourth one will be pointing 120 direct in direction so let's see how it works now when I put it here it's like pointing at this direction and when I put it here it's pointing straight here it's pointing up and here it's pointing down yeah, that's what I need so after that like I'll just make this separate or maybe I'll just keep that and now now keep an extra here if like uh, if the no, not mouse down it should be so just take a uh, not block from operators and keep mouse down there now duplicate this for all of them all of these ones and now go to go to this events take broadcast block and just drop it there and now what this message one is going to do is so i'm going to like when message one is received to like forever forever it should like um, uh, repeat until touching edge so it should like move so it should move 10 steps it should not only move it should feel like it's a little falling down so it should spin this degrees one time now let's see how that looks okay so it already gave the message Okay, so okay, that's a problem. So what I have to do is I have to like just take off all the blocks and just leave that broadcast in it and delete these two and put it in this place. Now let's see what happens. Then it's the same issue again. Okay. Now let's see how this works. Okay, so when I now keep it here, it goes there. Okay, so that rope is coming with the bird, so that should not happen. So now what should happen is like I should like uh, make an else block. Just keep a forever block and not this one. So, what I have to do is like if the 
when i receive message one just duplicate this keep it there just delete this and keep it there now let's see how it works so when i keep it here goes without it let me see it here okay. so they're not like that so let me make a new message or here search a message anything and now go here and change this to so now second now when i keep it here it goes well and and now when it touches the edge it should come back to its place so now after that i have to take duplicate this and i should like remove this from the forever and put this here and put this one here so now if it hit just the edge it will come back Okay, again the same problem is happening. So I'll just move this a bit back. Okay. Okay, the screenshot is not coming with it then. So the problem is that the script is still working after one turn. So. So now what you have to do is you have to like broadcast another message I'll just keep something and click okay go back to the script and now just take a duplicate and keep it with the message you kept now let's see how it works so i did it once and it worked am i doing the second time also it worked yeah now it's working well so that's the same mistake again it's working and then it's not working okay so the mistake is that so i don't like um, i if i don't need this uh, forever block so i'll just delete it and just keep it here so after that what i have to do is i'll just go to controls and take this stop all it should not be all it should be this script so it'll just stop this script only so now let's see if we can like might be able to do it multiple times yeah we can and also one more thing we kept this stops the script so we don't need this one anymore so i'll just delete it and this broadcast also deleted and there it's working so now the slingshot is working like that so now what i have to do is just turn this like that just turn this whole thing white so that we won't be able to see it like like that make it invisible by turning it white okay so now it will yep okay so now let so now let's like when it when this bird hits the pig it should like disappear so i'll just keep in a place where the bird might touch the pig so it did not yeah now it did so so i have to keep it there and go to the pig and now what i have to do is take a green flag option forever if 
touching bird which is this one it should hide and a show at the beginning so that we can see it in the beginning of the game so now let's see how it works yeah it worked and now let's just uh, like turn it on again to do it again now thanks for watching if you like this video please subscribe and click the bell icon